So having completed the panorama, we need to do a little bit of tidying up. If I just show you under the image menu and then image size, you'll see that this is a sizable image. Now carrying this amount of additional layers can add to the file size and they don't offer anything really. So I'm going to click OK. Then I'm going to turn on the visibility for the topmost layer. That of course will then hide anything lower down in the stack and we can go to the panel flyout menu, choose flatten image. So it will essentially collapse everything into a background layer when I click on that. Now, it's not something that I would normally do to delete that many layers, but as I say, they don't offer any real uh, value here because they're all hidden. We're going to be working on the merged version and that may as well now be collapsed into a background layer and we can build upon that. Final thing then is, of course, go to the file menu and save this as a PSD. So save as, and then I'll head up one level into the working folder, and then I'll just name this panorama underscore zero one. And just make sure that we save this not as a JPEG, but as a Photoshop document. We will build onto this. There is no point saving the JPEG to then only have to save a PSD version afterwards. And then click on save. 